Petronia City, is a 2,000-acre master-planned city development project, that aims to provide the first fully integrated business hub, for West Africa's oil, gas, mining, financial, and educational industries. The city will have three phases namely, industrial, technological, and financial sectors. The industrial phase will have a free trade zone, that will offer competitive prices for global industrialists, with tax incentives, and free zone benefits. The industrial sector will house, petrochemical clusters, steel plants, glass plants, food processing plants, assembling plants, and recycling plants. The city will have zoned off space for warehouses, and inland ports, that will boost the economy and GDP of Ghana and its neighboring countries. The technological hub is the second phase. This sector uses state-of-the-art hardware from China, and cutting-edge software from India. The hub will be equipped with fiber-optic cables running underground, which will offer support and innovation to all the zones of the city. Phase 3 is the foundation of Petronia, a financial hub and energy city. Similar to London's Canary Wharf, Petronia's financial hub will house the likes of Goldman Sachs, JP Morgan, Morgan Stanley, and other companies specializing in banking for investment and development, asset management, insurance, and trading. All the sectors will be sustained through pipelines, and power stations, that supply energy and water efficiently to the city. Commercial and residential facilities, are also expected to be built, including, a four-star hotel with a 200-seat conference center, four office buildings totaling 22,000 square meters, schools, clinics, and leisure center shopping malls. Nana Badiako one of the CEO owners of Capital 90, an investment company that is developing Petronia City, explained that it took him almost nine years, to seek the consent of over 65 families, 12 chiefs and three subdivision chiefs, men and women he invested time and energies in meeting with on a regular basis, to ensure they were aware of and involved in the three-staged process, to turn acres upon acres of African land, into an industrial free trade zone and investment community.